small fish becoming increasingly nervous moving off to the left of the screen and what comes in is a giant queenfish that's the species name <coughs> these guys are voracious predators feed on all sorts of things now if you have a look at them they are very laterally compressed compressed side to side this enables them to move in all sorts of crazy maneuvers they can uh, stop at the drop of a hat they can move sideways very quickly change direction incredibly Queenfish are well equipped uh, predators. They have large, hard mouths with short conical teeth. They also have eyes that protrude forward and look upwards. That means that they can see things in three dimensions and judge distances very accurately. You look at this guy, he's looking straight forward. Not many fish can actually do that. <coughs> They're uh, compress nature in their uh, their eye position means that they can feed in quite different ways to things like mackerel which are restricted to going almost straight forward when they're feeding these guys can go and pursue play <coughs> in all sorts of directions with lots of change in direction Queenfish often have small suckerfish remora attached to them. If you have a look, I've just circled one there. If you watch just behind the dorsal fin, you'll see the small remora start to move. These remora uh, feed on uh, <coughs> the waste from the queenfish, also any sometimes fish scraps and whatever's uh, left over after his meal. They're very frequently seen. <coughs> no doubt they also clean off parasites from time to time. Running down the sides of the queenfish is a wavy line. That's their lateral line. They use that to uh, pick up vibration so that not only uh, can see the fish they can also feel where they where they are from their vibrations and as they change direction they can tell where the vibration is coming from so they can hone in on it well-equipped predators There are a number of different types of queenfish living from inshore from estuaries all the way right out to the outer uh, Great Barrier Reef. This one is a giant queenfish. The largest of the group grow well over, well approaching one and a half meters. If you have a look at them they have a number of blotches that just touch the lateral line particularly the, the the forward ones and that makes it a giant queenfish it's by far the biggest there are a number of other smaller ones they're really cool looking fish underwater
Thanks for watching.